I'm going to talk about St. Emilio and Pomerol. This love affair with crafty new, style, new world style wines is still somewhat present in St. Emilio. Uh, and depending on the writer that you follow and the wines that you like, uh, caution. Big alcohols in some cases. What saved some St. Emilions in my estimate is putting a good dollop of Cabernet Franc in it. Uh, and of course some Cabernet Sauvignon, but Cabernet Franc definitely saves it. Uh, let's talk about it. Trop Long Mondeau. Uh, 15.5 alcohol. I mean, this, there's no second label. Everything was, was huge. It was just huge. It's crazy. Um, boy, it was a sexy wine. How long it's going to age, I don't know, but I certainly liked it uh, for what it is. It has its place in the wine market. Um, 83 Merlot, 3 Cab Franc, and 14% Cabernet Sauvignon. Really stunning wine. Cheval Blanc, pretty darn good. 56 Cab Franc, 44 Merlot. A little square, Subois, Briar, Leafy, Dusty, classic Cheval Blanc uh, tannins, packable fruit. Uh, Fijac, what can I say about Fijac? One third, one third, one third, Cab Franc. That's a Cab Franc, Merlot, Cab Sang. La Tour Fijac, great, great little wine, all bi mostly biodynamic. 25% Cabernet Franc, gives the wine some pipes to it. Very nice stuff. Larcisse Ducasse. Held a rosé for 20 bucks is great. I like the wine a lot. La Rosé, one of the stars of Saint Emilion for me. Loved it. Just a sexy, sexy wine. Uh, Bellefont Belsier. It's, this is the Dominic Hebrad uh, bought the estate. Uh, he's a former owner of Cheval Blanc. I think he knows how to make pretty good wine. He's done a great job again. Claude de Jacobin, for me, one of the sleepers. Bellevue, Lange Luce, great. And um, that was about it for my, what I, I tasted a bunch of other was, others in St. Emilion, but I'm very, very careful in what I taste in St. Emilion. Pomerol. Um, Pomerol is like going to Burgundy. Small estate, small estate. La Pointe, great. Conscient, very good. Cliné, Vieux Chateau Sertan. Holy smokes. Uh, I'm gonna, I, I don't know how I'm gonna get this wine, but speaking to Nicholas Tiempont, it's, he said it's the opposite of 2009. Low yields, mac maximum potential for full phenolic rises, no rot in the vineyard, deep, deep colored, 90 IPT, which is the measurement of tannins. Alcohol uh, is 1% more at 1475 versus 09. Wow. Th this, uh, this was a great, great bottle of wine. I loved it. 86 Merlot, 8 Cab Franc, uh, and uh, I think. Uh, I put 65 Cabernet Sauvignon, and that's not right because the math doesn't add up. So there's a little bit, I have to go back to my notes, a little bit of Cab Sauv in there. Uh, stunning wine, really, really liked it. And, of course, then in that I spoke about. So the offers are coming out now. We'll see what, uh, we, what transpires and what wines I get. Wines I get, excuse me. Thanks for listening.